so Pella and I are going to make some decorations like this. I found this on Pinterest to hang out by her new outdoor playground. What do you think? Are you going to help me do it? Uh -huh. Can you grab some of the things out of the bag, take them all out, put them on the floor so we can see what we've got to work with? Yeah. Alrighty. So what are you getting out first? Pom poms. Okay, so lay all the pom poms on the floor and all in one spot together. So we've got some pom poms. What else have we got in there? That's cool, what is that? Some pom pom ribbon. Looks nice. Look at all that beautiful fabric we've got to work with. This is gonna be fun. Do you think this is gonna be a fun activity? Uh -huh. Let's do it. I'm stripped. What colours? Okay, we finished ripping all of our fabric into piles. And Pearl, what have you got there? Some ribbon and some pom poms. Now we're going to start tying them onto these. Now I've got these. These are for making dream catches, and we thought these would be good for making these beautiful rainbow chimes to hang out in Pearl's play area. So I'm going to get Pearl to tell me what colours to choose. I think I put probably too, put too many on this one, so we might take a few of these off and uh, make another one. We are just making some more decorations to hang outside. Pearlie is playing with her Lego, and um, we've learnt something from the first one. So let me just show you what I didn't do on the first one was pull like on here. Let me show you all the the cotton off the edges. So you kind of need to pull all of these little bits of cotton off and it's focusing on pearl not this but all these little bits of cotton so this is my pile of cotton that i've gotten from my second lot here so, Okay, so this time I'm kind of doing it different. I'm just going to show you now. I'm just going to get a blue one. So last time I just tied them on in knots. This time I'm kind of doubling them over, not quite half, so it's a little bit longer. And I'm just going to thread them on back on themselves like this. And I'm not going to put as many on there this time. So this is what I'm doing now.
everybody, it's been Tradie Week. Hang on, I've got a possum that wants to be in the video. It has been Tradie Week this week. We had um, our new sliders put on our glass French doors so we have screens. Sliding screens, I think is the word I'm meant to be using. Let me show you then. And that went drama free. Tradie came, Daniel was his name, and he was awesome. So now... <laughs> Let me stand back. We have got these beautiful screens. Pearl, can you just pull the screen back so I can show what the screen looks like? Well, hang on, let me just get it started. All right, now, can you push the screen back? So these are Japanese pleated screens that just go right in here and you don't even know that they're there. So screens are in on both French doors. No dramas at all. Dan is busy out here building our deck. There he is. It's looking absolutely amazing. Dan. No dramas. Olympic, on the other hand, with our shed. You don't even want to know the dramas. Come on, Pearl, let's go downstairs. Hey. There has been so many dramas with our Olympic shed build. No. It's not even funny. Gotta leave that open, sweetie, we're going downstairs. We have been busy making a beautiful nature playground for Pearl as a part of her birthday present. And we are just going to go have a look at that now. Here, there's our pool, it's looking blue again. Woohoo! So Nature Playground for Pearl has been happening out here. And let me show you what we made. We made these beautiful, colorful wind chimes. See them? You would have seen us make them yesterday. So Pearl, do you love them? Yeah. They're so cool, aren't they? And they're all blowy in the breeze. And this here is going to be Pearl's sand pit. Mummy's just digging it out. We made some log jumping fun along here across the bridge into the trampoline. Pearl, can you show me how you do your log jumping? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Oh, can you do it with your thongs on? One of them's still a bit wobbly. I have to make it not wobbly. She can do it really good. There's Pearl's car. She's been practicing driving that all week. That's the wobbly one. And then she can go all the way along and into her trampoline to bounce. Had dramas with that too. Ordered a new cover, got the wrong size. So we'll take you down to show you the Olympic disaster later. There is just problem after problem with that build, seriously. Jumping jacks! Jumping jacks. Then we had a problem with the plumber. Just was coming to do the job, coming to look at it, all good, booked him in, waited two weeks, got a text from him half an hour before he's meant to be here. Yeah, I think the job's too big for me, I don't want to do it. On you mate, now we're a month out for Christmas and it's not going to happen before. I love these so much, they're so bright and fun. And we are going to finish this sand pit off. I'm getting a show. Pretty sure it's to make bedtime not happen, but I'm still getting a show and I'm going to enjoy it. And what a wonderful show it is. Hi, it's Saturday afternoon. We are uh, home from church, listening to some carols, and we are making bunting for Pearl's birthday. So this is a bit of fun at the moment. All I'm doing is very roughly folding my fabric into fours and then using it as a <coughs> using it as a template to cut these guys out. And Pearly, what are you making, doll? Our leg. Can I have a look? Did you glue it? Yes. Yeah, you might need to let the glue rest. Okay. I'll help her with her outlet now. <coughs> Got wings. Okay, so now we needed some scraps, didn't we? So you need to just get some fabric and just cut them up into 
little scraps. Can you do that? Yeah. Cut some little scraps up. Yeah. First, I folded them in half like this, and I got all the scraps, and I made like a little ball, flipped it over, and then I got a rubber band and put it over the top like this. You ready? There you go. And then I glued it. And then you're gonna go glue it and make it a uh, cat boy. Pearl, you're so clever. Can I show everybody the one you made before? This is her outlet that she made. She did all the gluing. I will because the glue is drying, I know. It's a bit messy. I'll hold it for you and glue down. Alright. Perfect. Wow, well done. Perfect, that's fantastic. One eye, two eyes, and a mouth. This looks fantastic. Mummy might get you some of her fabric glue in a minute. Now, should we put it over to dry? Yeah. I'll bring it over here. Mummy's got cat boy. And we'll, we'll put him here and Mummy might go get some 450 glue in the meantime to make these glue a little bit better. Pearl, you're so clever. Are you having fun? Yeah. Make some little bunting for your PJ masks. Yeah. What cut 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 out? Got all of this fabric. I don't know how to do that. So there's some Okay, so we finished making our small bunting for our doll house. We just sewed that one. And um, Pearl, what are you doing, doll? Decorating it. Here's some tape. Let's take a look around here. Ah, so she's taped up one side. And now she's getting it ready. Let's just turn the house around. And you're going to tape it up here. Come around the bottom there. Do you want me to hold it in place for you while you tape it? Yeah. I'll hold it. You put the tape across here. Other way, upside down. That's it. Washi tape comes in handy, doesn't it? Great for these sort of projects. Pearl, your bunting looks sensational. You can put it wherever you want. I made it for you and you're done. So we've had a fabulous afternoon making things. What did we make today, Pearl? Bunting. We did. And what did you make in your dolly's house? Bunting. And what did you make for all your little dolls? Blankets and covers. Did, did you do a good job? I think you did a fantastic job. Everybody had the right size blanket. Pearl told Mummy what size to make. Is that right? Have you had fun making things? Yes. Thank you so much for playing with me today. What are we going to play now? 
Guess who? Are you good at guess who? Yeah. I'm. I, she is very good at guess who. So I'm gonna have fun playing guess who with Pearl. Let's Good morning, possum. I have a cuddle. Yeah. Thank you so much. All right. The reason I've got this up is because your elf was doing something crazy this morning. Look up there. Ah! <laughs> Do you love it? Yeah. <laughs> what is he doing? Coming a bunny. <laughs> That's very cute, isn't it? <laughs> There's Pell's crazy elf. He's up there going from the curtains to the TV on bunting. You need wings like these. They're cool. And what are you doing? Flying with them. Awesome. <laughs> and she's off. So we're just out here. Um, we're going to try to hang this bunting that I made. Other day, we've got a whole bunch of bunching here. We made these ones where we just tied them on. These ones to Mom. hang up, but we're not going to do that today now because why, Pearl? Because it's too windy. It's so windy, but Pearl can fly like a birdie in the wind. Show us. So, our other job today is to get rid of this port power door. This has been here for a whole year now, a year too long. So we are going to sand it back and paint over it with blackboard paint. And it is going to feel good. Sorry all the port fans, but the pelt power door is going. Pearl is playing in her sandpit and we're just going to go put the blackboard paint onto the door and we're done for the day. So Pearly, can you tell everyone thanks for watching? Can you look at me? Pearl? Can you say thanks for watching? And next week our vlog's going to be about someone's birthday. I wonder whose birthday that'll be. Will that be your birthday or Pa's birthday? Mom. 